It's always a, a huge honour and privilege to play for Cook Islands. Uh, we're only a small nation with about 20,000 population back on, at the islands at the moment. So, um, you know, we're only a small nation, but uh, plenty of pride, uh, plenty of passion that comes with playing for us and we can't wait for it. I think just the, just the thing that we come from a small nation, uh, we are very small, but my dad's Cook Islander, um, so it's just about making him proud and my family proud to have my kids watching me play. That's probably the biggest honour is to have them in the stands while I'm playing, which is awesome. Yeah, that's massive for us. Um, obviously, we missed out in the last World Cup, so for us, it's about playing well, um, striving to make the quarterfinals, and hopefully the young kids watching from the islands or whether they're in New Zealand or Australia, they can be proud of us and want to copy us uh, in the future. I think we're probably the unknown. Um, you know, we've probably got one of the hardest pools. We've got Tonga, PNG and uh, Wales. So three really good teams. So we just got to take it day by day. Obviously we've got Wales first, so all the effort will be going into making sure we can get a win there. But at the moment we're not looking forward, uh, looking past them. The good thing about our team is we've got a a lot of experienced boys, but we've also got a lot of good young boys coming through. So, um, off the top of my head, there's a couple. Uh, maybe David Moale, who he played for South Sydney this year. He's a young prop. He's only 19 years of age. And then um, maybe Kale Ido, who will probably be our fullback or centre. He's um, Tony's nephew, um, son of former great Kevin Ido. So, um, I think he'll have a, uh, a big one for us. Yeah, I think it's massive. I think it's come a long way already. Um, I was lucky enough to play in the 2013 World Cup here in England, and I just feel like it's a different feel this year. Um, probably got more better players, um, and then to have the women's playing and the wheelchair is huge. So, um, yeah, I can't wait to, it's all the games on TV, aren't they? So I can't wait to be able to sit back and watch some games.